Well, joining me now from Coronation Street is actor Michael Lavelle, who, of course, plays Kevin Webster. And, Michael, you, you knew him, all of you knew him and loved him so much. It's a very, very sad day for everyone connected with Coronation Street. Yeah. <clears throat> um, Tony Warren, who was just um, a legend, he created this monster, which is Coronation Street. Uh, for someone so young, you know, what was 20, 23, 24, you know, and he's been responsible now for thousands and thousands and thousands of jobs, um, kids going through schools, universities, you know, ju just by those 12, 13 episodes he, he, he wrote all those years back. And it's just been um, a priv privilege to know him. Uh, he was such a um, flamboyant character. Um, and you'll miss him. I know that you will all miss him. And he, he changed television. He really did, Michael. He changed because it's, it's easy for us to, to forget now that actually before Coronation Street, there was, there was just nothing like it on television until he came along and, and created this magical show. That's right, yeah. I mean, there was certainly nothing, nothing around for like working class people, which was a, it was a big like champion of, of, of working class people, you know, and, and especially. Um, women characters as well. They was his favourite, you know, the, the, the strong female character who took no nonsense, you know, who, who give as good as the men, if not a, a lot more than the men, you know, and he, he liked to keep things real, you know, and true and gritty. And I, and I think um, a, lot, a lot of other te television programmes have, have followed that suit. You know, he, he did do the, the blueprint for it all. You're absolutely right. He was a complete pioneer. He really was. And I love the fact that you mentioned the female characters because you, you think of the likes of Ina Sharples and Hilda Ogden and all of these fantastic characters coming oh. right up to the present day. You know, the men were kind of a bit wimpy, but the women are always strong, aren't they? The, the women, he, he loved, he loved these strong women characters, you know, and like you say, even to this day, you know, you, you know, you've got your, your Sally's, your Anna's, your, your, your uh, Liz McDonald's, you know, they, they're still in the, in the show today, you know, they're, they're, they're like the linchpin of, of, of the show, um, you know, and, and, and that, that was what, what his, his passion was, his, his desire for was, was to, to get that um, coming, coming through their characters, the, it was just, Unbelievable what he's done, and I, I was so shocked to hear about his passing yesterday. You know, it's just like because I only saw him about a month ago. You know, he, he did used to come in the building like once a month. He used to go out for dinner. He he, he, he was still a hands-on kind of guy. You know, he, he he made sure the producers was going in the direction uh, what, what he had that vision of in, in 1960. You know, so uh, even even up to date producers didn't get away with anything. He was still there uh, keeping an eye on them all. No, that's good that he still had that involvement right up to the very end. You know, Coronation Street was so, so important to him. How will you best remember him, do you think, Michael? How will you remember this very, very special man? Just, just, the, just the, the fun he brought, you know. Um, he, he wasn't a drinker, but, yeah, he was alive and soul at the party. And you always knew when he was in the building because you could hear he, he, he had this deep, deep voice, you know, and, and this very loud laugh, you know, and he just... He just enjoyed life, he just enjoyed... He enjoyed being around Coronation Street, it was his passion. You know, and uh, I know when he wrote his book, C City Life, you know, and he had his uh, book launch in, in Manchester somewhere, um, Donis, Donis Speed turned up, you know, for his, his book signing, you know, and that, that was a few years after she'd left, you know, that, and that's, that's the passion people leave this programme with, you know, and, and it's... It is like one big family, and he created that one big family, and it, and, and it stood the test of time, you know, like, like no one's business. And I'm, I'm, I'm sure he was, he was still very, very proud of what he created uh, till the day he died. Oh, so he should be. Michael, thank you so much for sharing your, your memories of him. We really, really appreciate it. I know you've got a, a hard day ahead of you, and thank you. And it'll be a tough one for everybody at Coronation Street today. Thank you so much.